Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to MC Turtle with Super Turtle. How are you guys doing today? I'm doing pretty well. As you can see here from where I'm standing, our input level is at 41,000 RF per tick. Crazy, right? Well, not really if you consider what I've done off camera. So let's go ahead and... Oh, we're getting some lag. Let's go ahead and check out what I've done. Oh, look at that. It's our friend. This, my friends is our new reactor buddy and it produces quite a bit rf per tick if it ever loads hashtag butchers online so the server's lagging okay so as you can see here it's a seven by nine by seven fission reactor and we are producing 30,000 RF per tick here. Now, if I go ahead and crank up the volume like this, we produce over a million RF per tick. Uh, if we go home like this, it's pretty neat. Yep, as you can see, the input is uh, 1,002K, which is a million in, in K words. Yep, so as you can see, 977. So if we took that away, we'd be able to get over a million. Very cool, but today, guys, we are going to be experimenting with this flame spewer because if we look at the diamond recipe, I was looking at this earlier today. Um, thanks, game. We look here, right? We can get diamonds. We can get all this stuff from killing a Fletch lizard, or we can get it from killing this flame spewer, which killed by a player affected by looting. So I guess... I guess that to get this has to be killed by a player. Now to do that, uh, I think we can get a what is it like a mob masher or something like that? It's the spinny thing. We're just gonna test this guy out. So yeah, it's a mob masher. We're gonna give this a go. Uh, that should, that's actually not difficult at all to craft. Okay, so I went ahead and crafted it off camera. We've got it here. Now I do believe this thing needs power, uh, but what we do is we have ten sharpness upgrades and ten looting upgrades. So I believe we give this thing a redstone signal and it works. Okay, so it does drop all of that, unfortunately. Uh, but let's go ahead. We're going to test this bad boy out. Uh, let's grab some conveyor belts. All right, we're going to grab some of these guys. And we're going to grab a range add-on as well. All right, we're just going to get one, like a plus two. Yeah, okay. So let's let's give this a shot. Let's grab a lever while we're here. Just to make sure that that's what it is. Okay. So I'm going to move this guy down below. Whoop, 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 whoop. This is our wither farm. Yeah, we don't have any guys in here. Good. Okay. Um, Wither killer. Yep, still in there looking good. We're still waiting for wither skulls to come in. As you can see, there's only one in there. Pretty neat. You can see that. Uh, but let's set this up up here. Okay, and if you guys are wondering why I'm using a jetpack, oh, by the way, it's a creative jetpack, uh, the latest version of MC Eternal disabled the flight uh, from the Supremium armor, uh, which is really unfortunate, because I know that me and Shaw were both using it like that. So, you know, pr pretty sad, but um, yeah, we can make do. It would have been cool, though, if they added this here. Uh, but anyway, let's go ahead and we're going to we're gonna need a few blocks. Um, I didn't bring any blocks. Got a lot of nerve being alive. Okay, so let's go ahead. We're going to come up here like so. We're going to grab this guy. Okay. And if we put the range add-on, how big are we going? Okay, so that's where it will spawn. So we will put these like so that's not where that's supposed to go okay so we can go ahead and vein mine all the cobblestone we're going to put our mob masher in the middle here let's go ahead and see if we can place this on the torch we sure can because that will allow us to go down below we're actually going to do the corners just in case that will allow us to go down below and um, adjust it or toggle it from there Okay, we can break this torch. We can put our lever here. I believe it's just a lever. So if I do that, are we working? We're working. We're working good. Okay, so that's working like a dream. Let's go ahead and add in our sharpness and looting. Okay, and then we can 
not die. We can turn this off. And we're going to need to get a tank down here. I keep trying to double tap. Okay. We also have to put our slime boots back on, so we're bouncing a lot, which is annoying. Okay. So let's get an ender tank going. We're going to get two. We're going to make a custom channel for this. What are we missing? We're missing who? Okay, we're gonna grab two diamonds, like so. And then we're gonna grab some dye. We'll grab, whoop, Alexa's talking to me again. If you guys remember back a while ago, I think it was my uh, chemical exchange where I was really terrified when Alexa was talking to me. Okay, so we're just gonna go on the left side like that. And so that will be where the where we're pushing the essence into. So, so let's grab some extraction. Yep, we're gonna grab a few of these, and then some conduit, ender fluid conduit, just like that. And then let's come over here, over here, there, and we will put um this like so. Okay, so that will be pumping out of here. And should be able to place it like that and do this. Yep, that works below it. And then we can give it power from up top. Good. Disable limit. We don't really care about it. Okay, we can put our flame spewer. Diamonds, look at that. Okay, cool. So we are able to... To get diamonds from these guys so let's go ahead here and if you're wondering where the essence is actually coming from the original um it's coming from our farm so let's go for vacuum uh well, we're gonna try actually a vacuum do i have one of those i might have one uh we have this vacuum hopper which might be good um let's actually make a few of these and we're gonna make Okay, we're going to make some ender chest. Yeah, we're going to need to make some. Okay, and we're going to put these to our main guy so that we can get all the stuff. And let's see here. And we're just going to put one of these in each of the corners. So we actually need to make two more of these. It's always easy to have your main input for your system to be on triple white because everything... Who is using this for wither skulls? That is sad. So what happens if someone just, like, snags it? Watch it be me. Okay, so... Oh, my gosh. I forget. These guys, like, chuck items everywhere. So we'll put this here. This here. This here. And this here, we will put... Oh, not there. Well, rest in pepperonis. We're going to have to go grab that one. So each of these will have... Down will be items. Now, look at that. It is working like a dream, guys. Are we not able to get to the center? Is that what's going on? I think so. It's kind of sad. Might be working a little too well. Um, here, I got, I got an idea. So I would like to build this one one up. And maybe we do this method here. Yeah, see, that's, that's getting all the items. Um, so let's see. We face this way. This is facing north. So we'll go ahead. Oh. A little different. Yep, so we're working now. Everything seems to be okay. I believe this is a sucking up experience too. Yeah. Okay, so then we also need to enclose this, and I'm going to change the setup for each of these. Ooh, come on, come on, come on. 
Okay, so let's go. Let's go back to home base. Uh, it's so annoying. We're gonna have to get our our stuff going. Okay, so so this here like that. This on the back. So this should be facing east. Item, yep. Putting it in. Cool. So I'm just going to switch all of these to be similar to that, and I'll be right back. Okay, so we just got a barrier wall here to keep all the items in just in case. Everything seems to be working. Oh, we got some silverfish spotted in. Look at that. But this thing is working like a dream. Let's go see how many... Uh, Diamonds we have, but before that, what do you guys think of this? This is what I decided to do at the top of the building. I don't know how I like the roof. I think I might need to change up the roof a little bit, which won't take very long, but I do like everything where it comes up and cuts off here. I do like everything, but I don't know what I'm gonna do with the, the roof here. So your suggestions in the comments would be amazing. But this is what we decided to do. I like it a lot. Uh, I don't know what the support beam is, just, just wing it. I ended up removing the little pillar I had here, but I think this turned out really good. And if you guys like it, let me know down in the comment section. I'd love to know. Okay, so we are getting diamonds up the wazoo here. Ooh, look at that. We are getting, holy cow. Um, Yeah, we're getting a lot. We, yeah, diamonds are no longer an issue. Uh, we ha have our fortune guys going. How's our power consumption? Okay, how's, how's our, how's this guy doing? We're hovering right around the same. We're able to keep this up, but the problem I'm worried about is the other items we're getting, like gunpowder and stuff like that. Um, and the bags. Yeah, so other than the ore bags, we're going to be tossing the, all of these. We're going to be throwing them out. Uh, we don't want any of that. Bags of holding these guys are terrible. Because, uh, like, I don't know. I'll tell you later. So, but I think we we have automated diamond production. Um, it's coming up. We're getting a bunch of gunpowder too. Gunpowder is pretty good because we don't have a steady source of that, and gunpowder can be handy in the future. Uh, let's see here. What can we make with gunpowder? Anything cool? We can make uh, this guy. We can make a fell pumpkin. We can make a few other things. A lot of bombs and stuff like that. And this the guy, Molten Hammer. But that is going to wrap up the episode for today, guys. If you did enjoy the video, please make sure to hit that like button. And guys, off camera, I will go ahead and pretty up that farm that we have over there. It, will not, it won't just be um, marble. I'll make it look pretty good so that way we can, we can see the goodness coming out. But guys, we're filling up our islands. We might need to start making some more. So I will see you all in the next episode. I hope you all have a great day. I'll see you later. Peace out. I love your face. Bye-bye.